Charles Leclerc ended his wait for a Monaco Grand Prix victory with a composed performance on home soil. Charles Leclerc ended the Monaco Grand Prix curse on Sunday, managing the race to perfection to convert pole position into victory at his home event. Oscar Piastri finished in second, while Carlos Sainz held off Lando Norris to clinch the final spot on the podium. There was drama from the offset on the streets of Monte Carlo. Carlos Sainz made contact with Piastri giving him a puncture and sending him into the runoff area. Further back Sergio Perez's Red Bull was obliterated following contact with Kevin Magnussen at Beau Rivage, while Nico Hulkenberg was collected in the ensuing wreck. Further up the track the two Alpine cars came together when Esteban Ocon launched a move up the inside of Pierre Gasly at Portier. The driver of the number 31 car was sent airborne, and during the red flag period, the Enstone-based outfit were unable to repair the ensuing damage. That crash will have disastrous consequences for Ocon's next race. The 27-year-old picked up a five-place grid penalty for his troubles. While team principal Bruno Famin was furious in an interview with Canal, insisting that there would be serious consequences for the crash. The red flag left some drivers in a difficult situation. Leclerc, Piastri and Sainz were able to strap on new hard compound tires and fulfill their mandatory allocation. But the likes of George Russell, Max Verstappen and Lewis Hamilton were forced to move on to medium tires, 